Hello ladies, it's Suzanne, the beauty shaman. So I of all people know that self-care can get expensive. Great products can get expensive, taking care of ourselves, the cost can just add up. So today I wanted to give you six of my top money-saving ideas when it comes to self-care. Um, before I do that though, be sure that you hit the subscribe button and the bell at the bottom. And that means that you will be alerted every time I upload a video, which helps me to continue making great content for YouTube. Also, please visit my website at thebeautyshaman.com and see the store that I have there where I carry different skincare brands and use the code SB10 for 10% off anything you purchase. Okay, on to my top six. The first tip I wanna have for you is when you wash your face, only do it at night. You don't need to wash your face in the morning because your skin really isn't dirty. Your face really is only dirty at night. In the morning, just splash a little bit of cool water on your face and then do your regular routine. I just use Truth Treatments Peppermint Salicylic Face Wash um, every night when I wash my face, cleans off all my makeup, beautiful cleanser. Whatever cleanser you use, that's the one I use. You can get that on my website. Again, SB10 for 10% off, but only wash your face at night. You don't need to during the day. That automatically is going to save you product and help your face wash to go so much further. Okay, the second tip I have is, you know how you get, as you get older and you go through menopause, you get all those hairs on your face. So as I started to go through menopause, I noticed I was getting all this like more hair, not even peach fuzz. It was more than that. I started trying to tweeze it. Um, and then I went to my esthetician. Um, I'm an esthetician, but I, of course, see an esthetician. Um, and she did this blade, right? And basically took off all of the hair on my skin as well as exfoliated my face. Really cool. And then I thought, why can't I do that? So I started to do that. All you need is a razor. You can pay someone to do it or you can do it yourself. Trust me, I have been doing this for years. You just use a regular razor, does not have to be anything fancy. You can go out and buy a fancy one. They run upwards to $150, $200 sometimes for one of these um, exfoliating razors, but you don't need that. You just need a razor. Just go against the grain of the hair, right? Because hair grows down, go this way. I shave my entire face about every two weeks. That's it. I don't have to put any more money towards it. It's incredible. Just use a razor. Number three is to tweeze your own eyebrows. So you can go and get your eyebrows shaped. You can get them um, waxed or whatever you do. Um, I think it's like, what is it? Once every couple weeks, maybe once a month have that done in order for your eyebrows to look really great. Well, I actually avoid that by doing it myself. Now, if you don't know what shape your eyebrows should be, just measure. So they start here, they end over here, and right at your eyeball, right at the iris, is where the peak should be. So I do this myself. I just go through, grab my little tweezers, and shape them myself. Now you can also go and have them shaped, and then as the hairs grow back in, you just tweeze them. And that way you save that cost. I have not had my eyebrow shaped in years. I just do it myself. I also don't really care if it's not exact. And that's just my own preference. But that is a great way to save money. So you don't have to go in and fork out that cash every single month. Okay, tip number four in saving money is to hire a naturopath. Now you're saying, wait a minute, that's very costly. Why would I do that? The reason why that actually saves you money in the long run is that it's taking care of your inner body and therefore your skin becomes more vibrant, you feel better, your eyes are gleaming because you have health, you're not exhausted all the time, especially as we go through menopause. Um, I was so drained once I started menopause. I gained a lot of weight. I felt terrible. Once I went to see a naturopath, I got on all kinds of nutritional supplements. I changed my diet. I changed my exercise regime. I felt so much better. And what this meant is that not only did I feel better, I looked better. I spent less on trying to treat the external. In other words, I spent less on skincare products or um, makeup or things like that because my skin looked so much better, right? I only needed to use kind of a minimal amount of product. In the end, I think self-care always wins out because it's the long run. You're looking at the long run, not the short run. The short run is, you know, buy more stuff externally, but I'm not really for that. I'm for really taking care of your internal body, your spirit, your soul, um, your heart, your body, like all those internal things that really need to have the self-care. And that, my friends, is a great money-saving tip.
Number five on my list of ways to save money is kind of an unusual one, and I bet none of you would guess this, and it is meditation. So one of the things we do to spend too much money on ourselves is um, we feel bad. Okay, you feel bad. So you think, oh, I'm going to go shop and I'm going to go buy a new dress or I'm going to go um, buy another nail polish or whatever it is that you buy. Sometimes for me, it's lipstick. I'm a big lipstick fan. I have way too many lipsticks than is healthy for an individual. But rather than do that, it's much more important. Not, not that it's not good to go out and buy for yourself. Okay, I'm not saying that, but I'm talking about money saving tips here. So that's why I'm going there. Meditation makes you go inward. It helps you look into what's going on with me. And what you will find the more you do that is there's an incredible beauty inside of you. It is a beauty that wants so much to glow, but it gets covered over by our fears, our anxieties, external things that we have no control over that happen. Life just yanks us everywhere, right? As women, we get pulled in 50 billion different directions. How do you maintain your balance, your anchor, your sense of self, your self bonding in this crazy world that we live in? And the way that I recommend, one of the ways, there's lots of different strategies, but it's meditation. Get up in the morning. I'm very simple about it. I get a cup of tea. I sit down. I try to sit outside if it's not too cold. I close my eyes and I just observe, just observe my thoughts. And as they come in, I go, oh, that's an interesting thought and I let it go. I don't grab onto them. We spend way too much time grabbing onto our thoughts and exhausting ourselves. It's a money-saving tip to just go inward and choose peace. In fact, that's a great mantra for your meditation. I choose peace. Number six, money-saving tip, and my last tip is if you're going to buy any one expensive skincare item, what would that item be? And it would be serum. This is my favorite serum, Truth Treatments C Serum. I love this serum. It is $200. This will last you almost two months because you only need two drops. Why am I bringing this up as a money-saving idea? A lot of cosmetic lines will say, okay, here, buy this in, this whole thing. And you can't. I actually sell bundles. So if you want a bundle, absolutely. I've got lots of bundles on my website. Please visit thebeautyshaman.com slash store and you can see them. But that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about saving money. If your money is tight, just buy one item that helps with anti-aging, plumping your skin, that has loads of vitamin C, and it would be this product. It's so loaded with incredible nourishing ingredients for your skin. And this is a way to save money because if you use just that one product along with, you know, a good cleanser, um, a good moisturizer, and I don't even really need a moisturizer when I use this. It's so heavily packed with moisture. I actually don't even need it. So, you know, I don't need an eye cream when I use this because you can use it around your eyes. Um, what I'm trying to say is that one product can cover so many different products. And even though you're spending a hundred, you're not spending money on all this other stuff. So that's a great money saving idea. I highly recommend it. Just try one, right? It doesn't have to be this one. You can buy whichever one you want. I'm just saying I sell this. And if you use the code SB10, you get 10% off. So that's a great motivator right there. But if you don't use this brand, use a brand, buy one really awesome serum and stick with it. I hope these have been helpful. These are my six tips for saving money. And thank you so much for watching The Beauty Shaman. And ladies, have an awesome day and save your money.